What is good, everybody? I wanted to hop on here and talk about some things that have helped me with my attitude towards things and to motivate me to get things done. The first thing I want to talk about is when you wake up in the morning. The first thing that I started telling myself was, it's going to be a great day. It's another great day. It's another day for me to accomplish something, for me to get better, for me to grow. Instead of waking up and saying, oh, it's six in the morning. I'm getting up. I got to do this. I got to do that. When you start telling yourself these things, you're starting yourself off in a horrible mindset and you don't realize throughout the day it's going to keep coming up and keep bringing you down. So the first thing I want us all to do is to wake up and tell ourselves this is a great day. This is going to be a great day and then tell yourself what you're going to accomplish for the day. Even if it's just going out and having fun, even if it's just relaxing, relaxing is actually very good for yourself. You always need to take time for yourself to grow, to build, to think, and to just relax. And another thing I started telling myself, because I'm, I'm the type of guy that I'm all about energy. I believe uh, what you put out is what you get back kind of thing. So if you're sitting there talking negatively, eventually negative things are going to happen to you. But if you sit there and you talk positively, you can find a positive in almost any situation, guys. Even if it's a death, even if it's this or that, you can always find a positive. If you're always looking for negative, that is what your subconscious is going to do to you. It's going to make you always look for the negative things. So another thing that I have done is every day, whether it's when I first wake up, when I'm driving to work, when I'm just walking around anything, I start telling myself, uh, myself these simple things. You are strong. You are intelligent. You are hardworking. You have the courage to make the right decisions. You have the persistence to make those decisions become a reality. Learn, apply, action. No negative thoughts, all positivity. All positive thoughts. Do not let your fears control you. Do not let your fears prevent you from doing what you want. I repeat that, self to, that to myself consistently every day. And I've noticed when I wake up and I tell myself, man, it's going to be a great day. And when I say, you are strong, you are intelligent. You are hardworking. You have the courage to make the right decisions. You have the persistence to make those decisions become a reality. Learn, apply, action. No negative thoughts, all positivity, all positive thoughts. Do not let your fears control you. Do not let your fears prevent you from doing what you want. When I have started telling myself these things, I would say about two years ago, I started doing this to myself, religiously kind of thing, over and over. And man, I will tell you, my attitude has completely changed. I lost my parents probably, I'd say six, ago, six years ago or so. I lost my dad. And then about four years ago, I lost my mom. So I was in a slump. I was in a negative, negative, negative. And I have noticed ever since I started doing that, waking up and telling myself it's another great day, things are going to be amazing, my attitude has just gotten so happy. And even my girlfriend and everyone around me has noticed just, man, you are just a ball of energy now. And uh, telling myself those things as well. Uh, I've noticed my subconscious just naturally when something bad happens, I don't just be like, oh man, here I go. I'm going to get depressed again. I actually start looking at the positivity in it and enduring the moment. Another thing I've been telling myself is don't look for the end in situations. Enjoy the moment. Endure the moment. So that means like, Say you're at a say you work a hard job and it's very physically demanding. So a lot of people probably go into that job looking for that clock to be over, looking for their shift to be done. 
Well, if you're in the middle of your shift and you're actually telling yourself, man, look at this, look at what I'm accomplishing, look what I'm doing for people, look what I'm doing for myself, it's crazy how fast the time actually goes by and how much you actually start enjoying it. So I just wanted to hop on here and let everybody know that those two things have really helped my attitude and it's really helped me uh, get my motivation to actually do things instead of just saying, man, I want to do this, man, I want to accomplish that. I'm actually doing it now and accomplishing those things. So it's just really cool. And I think that those two things have a lot to do with it. You wake up and you tell yourself it's going to be a great day. You don't wake up and tell yourself, man, this sucks. I'm having to wake up this early or say you're going to bed. When you go to bed, tell yourself, man, I love my life. Man, I love what I got going for me tomorrow. Even if you know deep down you're not happy where you're at, you still have to enjoy the moment you're at and you have to learn from it and build. And that will make where you go even better. And then you will always remember those times. So I hope I made sense here. I know I talk a little fast because I want to get it out and I want to say it exactly how it should be, but I'm just being me here. Um, I hope everybody gets some positivity out of this. Hopefully this changes a few people's mindsets. If you guys are in depression or if you guys are negatively thinking consistently, um, try to change that guys. You don't have to think negatively. Things don't have to be miserable. You don't have to be depressed. You don't have to take a pill. You don't have to go out and get drunk. You don't have to get high. You can really just talk to yourself and it helps you tremendously. Um, that self-talk is very, very important. If you're not talking to yourself in, in a positive way, in a good way, and you're always breaking yourself down and you're telling yourself, oh, I'm ugly, oh, I'm fat, or I'm this, and then you're like, well, man, why am I not going out and working out? Well, you don't realize that your, your subconscious is building off of those negative thoughts. So your subconscious, when you tell yourself you need to go work out, all it's going to do is say, well, why work out? You're ugly anyways. You know, and that's the worst mindset to have. So make sure you're talking to yourself right. Make sure you're telling yourself, yeah, I may not be the best looking guy ever, but man, I look good. I'm going to do everything I can to make what I have to work with work, you know? So definitely, guys, let's work on our self talk. Let's make sure when we go to bed, we're not miserable and telling ourselves, even if we had a horrible day, learn from that horrible day. Don't just say, man, this sucks. There's nothing I can do about it now. No, there's everything you can always do about it. Yes, you can't change the past, but you can learn from it and change your future. So definitely, guys, I hope you got some positivity out of this. I hope this helps you in whatever you're going through in life, whether you already are somebody positive. Hopefully my saying, what I say to myself again, I know I've already said this twice and I'm sorry if I keep repeating myself, but I always say you are strong, you are intelligent, you are hardworking, you are confident, you have the courage to make the right decisions, you have the persistence to make those decisions become a reality. Learn, apply, action. No negative thoughts, all positivity. All positive thoughts. Do not let your fears control you. Do not let your fears prevent you from doing what you want. I also go deeper into it sometimes and I go, you are strong. Nothing can hold you back. Nothing can bring you down. You are intelligent. You have the knowledge you need to get what you need done. You are hardworking. No one will outwork you. You are the hardest worker in the room. You are confident. You know you are on the right path. You have the courage and the tools to make what you want happen. You have the persistence. You will never give up to make those decisions become a reality. Learn, apply, action. No negative thoughts, all positivity. 
Do not let your fears control you. Do not let your fears prevent you from doing what you want. Say You don't have to say all that. I know I go a little extreme in everything I do, but definitely talk to yourself right, guys. Um, wake up. Tell yourselves, this is going to be a great day. Go to bed telling yourself you love your life. You love yourself. And if you do that consistently, it's not going to happen overnight. It's not going to happen in a week. It's not going to happen in a month. I would say when I first noticed a change in myself, it was about six months down the road. When people actually started saying they noticed a change, it was a year down the road. So definitely, guys, like they say, nothing happens overnight. You got to work on it. But let's work on it together. Like I keep saying, I hope this helps somebody out there. I hope it helps a lot of people out there. But even if it just helps one person... That's what it's all about, guys. I hope everybody's having a great day. Much love. Have fun. Enjoy life. Live priceless.